Hello, my name is Thomas Depon. I'm the product planner for our high-speed arbitrary waveform generators at Keysight Technologies in Germany. When doubling the switching speed of data centers every 18 months, test instruments need to stay ahead of this race to enable the industry designing next-generation transmission systems. Whether testing the discrete components of a coherent optical system or experimenting with terabit transmission systems, engineers need the highest speed, bandwidth, precision, and flexibility. In this video, I will give you an overview of Keysight's new high-speed arbitrary waveform generator, the M8199A. The M8199A has four differential channels integrated in a two-slot XIE module. Each channel can operate at up to 128 giga samples per second with 65 gigahertz of nominal bandwidth in a very smooth roll-off. The bandwidth allows us to go even higher in sampling rate by interleaving pairs of channels to generate a record sample rate of 256 giga samples per second. By applying an advanced in-system calibration, the roll-off can be compensated to extend the usable bandwidth of the M8199A up to an outstanding 80 gigahertz. Combining two channels with a passive combiner reduces the amplitude by about 50%. In order to compensate this loss, we recommend the M8158 remote head when operating at 256 giga samples per second. But there's more that makes this a really great instrument. We give you a high degree of flexibility to configure this product. You can start with a two channel 128 giga sample per second module and upgrade it through software to a four channel instrument. Then add the interleaving option with remote heads and you end up with a two channel 256 giga sample per second AWG system. Adding a second AWG module gets you to eight channels at 128 giga samples per second or four channels at 256 giga samples per second. Of course, fully synchronized. The M8199A operates with all the software tools you already know from previous AWG models, such as MATLAB, IQ Tools, M8070B, and of course, Skippy programming. But now I'm sure you can't wait to see some example signals. So here we go. First, I want to show you an 80 gigabaud signal and to make things a little bit more interesting, I'll do a PAM8 signal. Not PAM4, but, but PAM8 right away. Next, we'll switch to a 112 gigabaud PAM4 signal. And you notice with this one, we had to reduce the roll off to uh, compensate for the bandwidth of the AWG. But we can go even further and take a look at a 144 gigabaud PAM4 signal. Next, let's switch over to coherent optical signals. And as an example, I want to show you a QAM64 signal running at 112 gigabaud. As a proof point for my statement about usability up to 80 gigahertz, let's take a look at a multi-tone signal that has been equalized on the transmit side to be flat out all the way to 80 gigahertz. And finally, let's take a look at an RF signal. Uh, in this example, I will be showing you a 16 gigahertz wide QAM signal that is centered at 39 gigahertz. It's a direct RF signal generation out of this wideband AWG. As a final example, let's take a look at an even higher center frequency. Uh, this one is a two gigahertz wide signal centered at 71 gigahertz. I give you an overview of the new M8199A AWG that provides highest sampling rate and widest bandwidth on the market. It's a fully integrated, ready to use instrument and it offers great deal of flexibility in terms of waveform generation and product configuration. Thanks for watching.